Hello my little woolies, I hope you're fine wherever you are. In today's tutorial we're going to learn how to knit the pearl brioche stitch. It's a great introduction for brioche knitting because it's easier and getting familiar with the main steps takes very little time and effort, unlike brioche. This is a great stitch, spongy, full of texture, Beautiful, really cute, perfect for knitting blankets, sweaters, cardigans, cowls, and many other projects. Just four rows. So stay with me, let's get started. Firstly, we need to cast on an even number of stitches, including the edge stitches, the first and the last. Remember, you will find the written instructions on my website, sowoolly.net. There is a link for you below this video on the description box. First row, wrong side of the work. We're going to slip the first, always, netwise, and now comes the repeat. Yarn over, slip one purlwise, Net one and repeat. Yarn over, slip one purlwise, net one. Again, yarn over, slip one purlwise, net one. Yarn over. Slip one, knit one. Yarn over, slip one, knit one. And end the row with purl one. Second row, right side of the work. Slip the first, knit wise. And now comes the repeat. Knit one, knit two together, the yarn over and the next one together. Knit one, knit two together. And repeat. Knit one, knit two together. Knit one, Knit two together. Knit one. Knit two together. And purl the last one. Third row. Slip the first, knit wise. Knit one. And now comes the repeat. Yarn over, slip one purlwise, knit the next. And repeat. Yarn over, slip one purlwise, knit. Yarn over, slip, knit. Yarn over, slip, knit. Keep repeating until there are only two stitches left and end the row with knit one and purl one. Row four. Slip the first knit wise, knit two, one, two. And now comes the repeat. Knit two together, the yarn over and the next stitch, knit one. Again, knit two together, knit one. Knit two together, knit one. Knit two together, knit one. And purl the last. These four rows create the pattern. Repeat them until the desired length is reached. When finished, bind off netwise after a row three. 
and this is it for today, my little woolies. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Stay home, stay safe, and happy knitting.